Now getting on the home page on Clipchamp, I saw an interesting tab that just came up recently and now with the conversations about AI, the use of it, benefits and drawbacks of AI, we are seeing something that may not be seen yet on Clipchamp which is how can you take advantage of AI in terms of creativity and alongside most importantly productivity on this space and so here we have create a video with AI quickly auto compose a video using your own media and so looking at this I was like hmm this got my curiosity let me click on this and let's see what this has for us in here and so let's begin now here is a preview of how it looks like before we get into the magic and looking at this here it says here that let's start with your content every good project starts with a name and let's say we're going to remake a video that i didn't made a couple of years ago or build on it once we have this as our title let's look at the different types that we have here we have a type for holiday wedding memory slideshow others let's see what others has to offer you can type whatever you have here let's say for example we have podcasting or something like that i don't know and then it says here that add your media and uh, in here we're going to add media or drag into here so let's drag this image over here oh dragging works that is good or you can just hit the plus sign and it takes it to the specific space on your computer to get those information from oh it's already the on that the same so the ai kind of recognizes that two images they are the same so you cannot add the other one in there so that's interesting so let's say we have this and we want to now let's get started let's see what this has to offer for us so get started let the magic begin and okay this is good in here it says so tell us what style you would like for your video so we have simple clean uh choose for me okay well yeah let's click that um bold okay so these are what it means for it to be bold okay uh, vivid eye catching okay uh let's say yes uh editorial okay that is good playful okay um vibrant oh yeah let's click yes for everything and let's see what this is going to give us dynamic yeah dynamic elegant okay vintage organic and that is all for now finalizing your video so let's see drum roll almost there so here we have it we have two options we have the landscape version and we also have the portrait version and in here it tells us that how long should your video be is it less than a minute pretty much around the short um region of all let's say tiktok style of videos or is it about three minutes or full length videos and so this is fascinating to see these options here and let's look at the portrait version which is what we have here we have around 42 seconds long and in here when it's loading we're going to see what it has for us and we're going to hit play and I'm kind of curious to see what it's going to be you know what is capable of what the result is like here hmm the first one i discovered in an exoplanet close to earth okay that is a nice preview of the location uh, the, the interesting thing about this is of course i mean they introduce music as well to this video how is this going to infringe on copyright issues or stuff like that so there are a lot of worrying things that you know hopefully with a lot of testing we can cipher and see through which particular type of music it's acceptable and which other music might you know we get you in danger of copyright so i'm really optimistic about the product that we have here based on the portrait mode and also the choices of the images that were shown versus what the part of the video is actually revealed for this one minute long version now looking at the long version alongside the shorter version which involves the sh portrait mode we notice that they actually have the mirror plane that is revealed here just to use the space that is available for the video portion of this particular 
video and so this is really awesome to see the choices of filters that are going on here in terms of the color mode alongside also the little bit of animations that are played around right from the beginning over here as you show the images and also let's say the collage of those in there and you can see also that this particular video tends to zoom in and zoom out as it goes on in its play run so really fascinating to see the choices here when it comes to the result in addition this shows a cutout of the main video portion that neglects the other background and focuses mainly on me in regards to pasting the main images that are going to be talked about in the video so i'm really interested to see the choices that are being played right here alongside that of the music choice that i chosen for this particular video and how is this going to of course change your perspective or change the mood of this type of videos that you are actually creating so let's see now the next part here by choosing landscape and full length and by going next let's see what we have here so we have choices of music to finish off your video we can have happy place you can also click on all the types of music that you can go and also you can export it wherever that you want in going back as well you have front size in terms of the preview you can change the front size to whatever you want in here we'll pick this and this here is how the front size is going to look like in terms of just the introduction to the video and next here is going into not a fan then you can create a new version if you want or you can move on by edit in your timeline so this is fantastic to see how this is going to look like when we click on this and let's see what the result is going to look like on the timeline and yes here is a timeline that we have right here which shows you from the title to when you're going to be able to figure out various segments of the timeline like for example we have a space here for the background color alongside what color to change in terms of what you want at this side of the screen and it's quite fascinating alongside how to put the fading effects in there if you want alongside maybe some interesting captions in terms of what we have for specific video part over here and on the right side we have some interesting clips that are going to be having a background around it that is integrated in here so it's really fascinating as well to see the use of some transitions that are seen in here from one cut to the other quite a well detailed transition here with regards to that and i'm really interested to know your thought about how you can navigate through this either for example clicking on this we have various options in terms of the fading to the effects to adjust color and other fun options that you can play around with here rather than doing everything from scratch so this here as you see is just a foundation and then you can build on it as time goes on before you make that final edit or final upload so i'm really excited to take advantage of some of these maybe take away some of the edits i already done here and putting my own spin on it this here is just a suggestion and also most importantly looking at the music choice that is right here below you can change the music to whatever you want or reduce the volume as you see right here and also maybe the speed of the music so I'm reading your thoughts about this AI generated video by Klimchamp and let's know your thoughts about this in the comment section down below. Are you going to take advantage of this or will you still stick to your own version of it? All the same, stay smart as always and believe in yourselves.